Hi, I'm Lindsay Klein. This is the WDHA Homegrown Spotlight, and we are going to talk to two members of LMA. Craig and Chris are reincarnated in their so fresh and so clean, clean, and really awesome sounds. They've been touring and doing fantastical things, and let's hear about it now. Hi, I'm Lindsay Klein, and this is the WDHA Homegrown Spotlight. I'm with CNC Music Factory. <laughs> Everybody dance now. <laughs> this is Craig, and this is Chris from LMA. 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 LMNOP. You know, that's almost like an abbreviation, LMAO. Like, did, okay. We've, we've been there. <laughs> it's, that's, that's happened. It's an E. It's been discussed. LMA. It's been used for other things. How long has LMA been around? 12 plus years. Wow. Yeah. That makes you guys really young. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> totally. 12 plus years um, as Not a consistent. band. Yeah, we, we broke up in 2008 did nothing for a few years mm -hmm. and now Chris and I are doing a lot rekindled yeah. Yeah. their We're love for each other they they're dancing music. <laughs> well you've been doing a lot uh, Europe yeah? yeah yeah how was that that was fun that was how did you surreal. get into that uh, really it start the label we're on wanted an acoustic song from all their artists. We had already written it, so we went and recorded it, and then uh, they just said, why don't you come over? Oh, okay, so they're based in Europe. Yeah, England. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it was it was basically, you know, we, we weren't playing together, and that, that compilation was the reason why we started doing something together again, because I, you know, I, I happened to say, like, hey, what if I asked Chris of LMA, do you want to, you know, make some music again we we can add a song to the comp and they were like sure if you want to do it go for it mm -hmm. that really um you know sparked the whole ball rolling. well being on a label is pretty rare for my homegrown spotlight blogs so talk about that how did you get how did you get on this label one of you shudder to think tribute right yeah we did it we did a song um by a band called shudder to think on a tribute cd that was probably in 2002 or three and uh, we asked to be on that tribute. We knew the label was putting it out, um, and um, they said record it. We'll see how it is. Okay. You know, so so we so we did that, and um, that turned into the guy there saying, "Hey, why don't we release something from you guys?" And they put out a seven inch, mm -hmm. um, and uh, from there it's just been a continuous relationship. Engin awesome. It's Engineer Records. Engineer Records. Okay. Very very cool. Not a lot of people are on labels or anything, so I'm sure they'd be interested to, you know, know how you did it. Thanks! It's exciting! Talk about the sound of LMA. How would you describe it? Uh, the band, I mean, obviously acoustic is acoustic, but, you know, the vibe. How about just answer it how you want it? Indie it. slash summer classic rock? Have you been compared to anybody? We've had, a, we've had a, when we used to play more avidly as a full band, you know, we would we would be that band that would not fit here, here, or here. We would kind of play with the hardcore bands. You know, we, were, we definitely played with mostly post-hardcore bands because as a band we had more of that sound. But we did have, I guess, a much more um, fuller fuller sound. You know, we, we, we would have stripped down stuff like, like acoustic stuff already on our albums. You know, and we would have some pretty heavy stuff. Um, not aggro heavy, you know. But I guess we were always kind of that band that we always felt like we didn't fit with, with the current... <laughs> You know, with what all our friends were doing, so. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, you know. it's got an indie vibe for sure, but that's why I love it. Yeah. That's why I love you. <laughs> you stand out. And definitely the loudest, powerful voice we've had on our blog. Thank Lacey you. and I were very impressed. Hopefully yes. that was good. It's, it's positive. Yeah. Thank positive you. stuff. All right, well, tell everybody where they can find your music. Music. Um, yeah. Well, actually, now, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to think. Like, we, we existed... Uh, initially before Facebook. This is reincarnation. It is, mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. This is re I'm, Yeah, we have to say that. It's definitely reincarnation. Um, there's a Bandcamp site. So it's um, lma.bandcamp.com. has all of our material up there, like literally everything. Um, we have up there for stream. Engineerrecords.com website has stuff. iTunes, any digital area. Physical if you need to. Amazon. I mean, wherever you want to go, we could find our old albums. Okay, yeah. great. Last question. You might have answered it before. Craig's not new to the blog. He's in another one of my favorite bands, Damn This Desert Air. Shameless plug. Uh, last question. Maybe Chris wants to take it. 
because you answered it last time. Bands just starting off, original artists, whether they're doing something acoustic, full band, piece of advice. Stay true to your heart and write. Write and play what feels right to you and not what may or not be right to anyone else. Craig, Chris, Alame, thank you guys so much. Thank you. Thank you.